So about two years ago, uh, we got an X-Carve from Inventables uh, at work, and I absolutely love this thing. Uh, it's super easy to use. It came with the Easel Pro membership, and um, I really like using that. And I love everything about it except the bed size. So it's less than 30 inches in both directions. And that's just a big nuisance because everything you buy, uh, at least where I live, is going to be in 4x8 sheets. And so you have to cut it down in weird ways to get it to fit and you end up with a lot of waste of material and it limits what you can cut because it's just not that big. So I was really interested in upgrading to a 4x8 machine and I wanted to stick with the X-Carve ecosystem because that's, that's what I know how to use. I'm really comfortable with it. Um, the problem is they do not sell an, a 4x8 machine. I don't know why, but their biggest one is only 4x4, and um, it's going to cost you upwards of $10,000, especially if you get add-ons. So that is just not an option. Um, so I came across a company called Zenbot, and they sell a very affordable 4x8 CNC kit. I haven't found any that were anywhere near this price they're usually much more expensive and you're going to be able to reuse several parts of your x-carve with this uh, kit now they sell their own controller but um, it uses a special port that my computer doesn't have and I'd have to use a whole new software that defeats the purpose I want to use easel pro so we're gonna save ourselves 530 bucks and reuse the x controller from our x-carve so I ordered the bare bones kit from Zenbot, um, no controller or anything, and uh, we we're just putting it together. Now this is going to be able to reuse the router from our X-Carve and also the X controller. So that's saving us uh, several hundred dollars there. And it uses different plugs, but if you know how to solder, it's not a big deal. Um, and you can just use the same connectors as the X-Carve here plug it all up and as far as um, like running it is plug and play as far as being able to move things but it does require uh, some calibration because the motors aren't exactly the same so especially the z-axis on this one um, it's instead of a worm drive it's sort of a direct belt so that's going to be way off you're going to have to calibrate that if y'all are interested, I can uh, maybe do a video showing how you can change all those settings in Easel. But um, I am super happy with this thing. It works just like the X-Carve. It's the exact same workflow, except now I can cut entire sheets of plywood and MDF. Um, I added my own wasteboard here and surfaced it to get a nice flat surface. And this thing is awesome. It uh, I've done a ton of cuts on it already and I can actually cut um, much deeper and much faster because it's a very rigid platform so um, I've had great results. I love this thing and if you're interested in a 4x8 machine this might be it.